I'm Charlotte, I'm, uh, I work at Plymouth University. I did my undergraduate degree in chemistry here initially, so it's a BSc, and then after that I decided to do my postgraduate course, so my PhD in chemistry, and that constitutes uh, three to four years of research, so working in a laboratory and gathering data to, uh, to answer a scientific question. I never specifically decided to go into higher education, I think it was just something that I knew I was going to do, purely because the kind of career goal I had required having a certain qualification and that meant I had to go to uni to get it. But I think there would have been plenty of things outside of higher education that I could see myself doing as well. I just feel that for me, higher education resonates with me because I, I like to learn things and I'm a learner, I like to do things and learn new things, so that's why I feel higher education for me was just my natural progression. If you can get work experience or any kind of experience outside of school, um, I feel it's really important to do so because interviews to get into university, interviews to for other part-time jobs, anything, you can always draw on these experiences and they're competency-based interview questions. Um, so you can talk about all of your transferable skills. It helps you relate to people, um, network. It's, it helps you realise what maybe you do want to do and what you don't want to do as a career as well. So I think it's really important to get as much experience as you can. My teachers from school and my parents included were very encouraging and very inspirational and very positive, which was great. But I think the bottom line, the message that they conveyed to me was just work hard and just choose whatever you feel naturally drawn to. Um, and that advice hasn't led me down the wrong path so far. 